Hello, my friend. This is Ken, and I'm going to show some design concepts of the HVAC system in our office. And let's put the office into a CAD drawing so that we can see everything clearly. So it is an office of 850 square meters, with 52 meters long and 18 meters wide. And there are more than 30 persons to work inside we set two main working area here and a showroom in the middle. The conference room and manager room are at upper side and canteen, dream room and washroom at lower side. As well as two machine room at both ends to put the HVAC equipment. To create a comfortable, healthy, and productive working environment, a reasonable fresh air distribution way is very, very important. We use two energy, re energy recovery air handling units. We call it ERV here, to each to serve half of the office. And we set the supply dot here as the green one you can see in the drawing. And the exhaust starts as the orange one here. And so that the fresh air would be introduced from the upper side and keep ventilating through the whole office and exhaust it here. So the indoor air will be replaced and changed sufficiently and frequently. And so that everyone in each corner of the office could enjoy plenty fresh air. So uh, let's turn to the beam joint so that we can see it in a, another angle. And this is the beam joint of our whole office. And another key point that we all trace for is high energy efficiency and low energy consumption. We take three solutions. Number one, heat recovery. You know, our office will work for more than 10 hours per day and the summer here in Guangzhou is very, very hot. And during the working time, the energy recovery air handling units, the ERV, would recover the energy from the exhaust air and preheat or precool the fresh air before sending it into indoor. And then, so as to reduce the indoor air conditioning workload, heat recovery will cut a great amount of the energy consumption of the indoor cooling system. And then the second point is the variable speed fan control. In each of the room, we would set the fresh air damper here, you can see, and then the ERV will regulate its fan speed according to the feedback signal from the damper. So the fan's power can be reduced accordingly when the room is not occupied. And number three, the VRF system. We use VRF system for indoor cooling and heating. Each indoor unit could be controlled separately so as to fit everyone's comfort need without any unnecessary energy loss. In a word, the ERV ventilation system and the VRF indoor air conditioning system work together as an intercoordination by an intelligent control system so as to help us create a comfortable building air quality, while the energy consumption of the whole HVAC system is always kept economical and just right for the demand. Now, let's have a look at the control system. So here is the uh, slim and small control box here. And you can see a touch screen here, and what we need to do is just to Turn on the ERV one by one. Now, ERV number one and ERV number two. 
and we can also read the indoor air quality from this control panel as you can see the, uh, the office temperature and the humidity and the CO2 and PM 2.5 and now it is a VRF system we just need to use a small controller done simple and easy isn't it so next I'm going to have my colleague Johnny to show you the equipment Johnny please